Hi, my name is Namrata. Today I will explain how we can mitigate the effects of reading interruptions by providing reviews and previews. This work was done in collaboration with Adobe Research and the University of Melbourne. Nowadays, the number of people reading on their phones is increasing day by day. Further, for effective reading, it is suggested that we should either postpone the interruption or avoid interruptions while reading. However, in real scenarios, these interruptions are mostly unplanned and therefore unavoidable. What do we need in such scenarios is a tool which can help us re-engage with the reading task. How about a review or a summary of the text you have just read till now? Too. These reviews can help you or remind you of what you have read. Further, how about a preview or a summary of the text you will be reading next? These previews can help you to motivate to read further. In this late breaking work, we conducted a series of pilot studies to understand the benefits of reviews and previews in mitigating the interruptions. The basic flow of the experiment looks like the basic flow of the experiment consists of multiple reading rounds. In each reading round, the participant have to read a passage. Uh, while reading the passage, the participants were interrupted in between and asked to complete three interruption tasks. After reading the part, after reading the passage, the participant answered ten multiple choice comprehension questions. For the reading task, we chose fictional and non-fictional passages from standard reading literature databases. For interruption, we chose interruption which requires certain amount of mental effort. For example, letter task and mental mass, they were considered as memory wiping task. And the key and the Tetris game is considered as an active active distraction task. And the Tetris game is considered as an active distraction. In the letter task, the participant was shown a sequence of letters and they were asked to remember it. In the math task, the participant were asked to perform fast addition for 20 seconds. Finally, for the Tetris task, the participant were asked to play a game of Tetris for one minute. The experimental setup consists of three pilot studies. For the first pilot study, we we used a between subject design with shorter passages. For the second pilot study, we used the same between subject design but with longer fictional passages and 8th grade US reading level. For the third pilot study, we switched to within subject design with longer non fictional passages with 11th to 12th grade US reading level. We next evaluated the effects of priming cues on reading comprehension at different locations like previews after, preview before, review after, review before or no summary. We found that for pilot 2, where longer fictional passages were shown, participants who viewed priming cues scored higher than participants who didn't see any priming cues. Further, for pilot 1 and pilot 3, participants who viewed previews after the interruptions scored better than the participant who saw no priming cues. When asked, when participants were asked for the preference of the location for the previews, 43% of the participants they like to see previews after the interruptions, 30% like to see previews before the interruptions, and remaining 27% they like to see any previews. Similarly, for the reviews, 76% of the participants would like to see the reviews after the interruptions, 16% before the interruption, and 8% no reviews. Overall, the participant had a, had a positive experience with the priming cues. Uh, only 21% didn't like only 21% of the participants found the priming cues repetitive and unnecessary. Remaining 79% had positive experience with reviews and previews. As a next step, we would like to generalize this study to larger population and conditions closer to reading in the wild. Further, we would like to test different kind of summary priming representation beyond summaries such as list or mind maps. To help you recall my presentation, uh, this is a review of the presentation. Hope you like the presentation. Thank you. For more details, please read our paper. Thank you.